Mama Frank on TV again. All right, so I'm back again, and I guess you can say this will be my first vlog, or I guess you can say the first time that I actually just specifically spoke to the camera. It's late. I really should be asleep, but I kind of felt like rambling off some of my random thoughts that I have throughout the day, and especially whenever it gets to the point where I should be asleep and I can't really sleep, and then I grab a cup of coffee, and it's like, oh, that's strong. It's like one of my favorite things to drink besides Coke. I don't really drink any water. All right. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, like my random thoughts. Well, one random thought that I had earlier, uh, actually probably about an hour ago, was who came up with the phrase when, when pigs fly, not when cows fly. That would be totally impossible. Pigs fly in two, definitely impossible. But were they drunk? Were they high? If they wanted to come up with something that was impossible, definitely a pig flying I mean but you put a pig in a like a very very large slingshot then would it be flying I know that was completely stupid like count sheep when you're trying to go to sleep there aren't any sheep in my room to count whenever I'm trying to go to sleep pretty sure that if there were sheep in my room I wouldn't be able to sleep yeah I definitely want to get some clippers and Get me some wool, you know what I'm saying? Um, why is it so hot in here? What's gonna be the next big thing? I know it's like not a wild dog, but a serious dog. What's gonna be the next big thing? Hey, you got Facebook, that's pretty big. Twitter, that's pretty big. Instagram is blowing up everything right now. Pretty much you can sync all of them together. But what's gonna be next? I was thinking about superpowers earlier. If I had a superpower, what would my superpower be? I think it would be either to catch things on fire at will, or would be able to be like Superman, but not Superman, because I don't really don't like Superman. I'm really a Batman fan. So I guess you can say I would be Batman with Superman's powers. Yeah, I think that'd be it. Batman with Superman's power. Super Bat, that's what they would call me. Super Bat. When dogs dream and they're chasing something in their dream, what are they chasing? Is it a rabbit? Is it a dog? Or is it just the running pebbles that they eat all the time? You know, they say that dogs are supposed to be like wolves that have like devolved, like domesticated wolves pretty much. They never eat any, like, they eat, never eat any game. They never eat any rabbits. They never eat any like live stuff that they chase, uh, especially like domesticated dogs. Like, so what are they chasing? Are they chasing the little kibbles and bits? Or doggy bags? Like what? Like who knows? If you ever met an alien, what would be the first thing you say? Uh, please don't shoot me. Don't make me a slave. Don't probe me. We come in peace. Well, if you're by yourself, I guess you you come in peace, not we come in pieces, meaning that experiment on me and ch experiment on me and chop me up. When the earth runs out of oil, what's going to happen? I'm going to crawl into a hole and hope no one finds me. I was thinking the other day, like, what would people do if randomly one day just Facebook just was down? All social media just like randomly went down one day. Like how much chaos would go on on the planet? Like everyone would just stop. People would call in sick to work. The world would be in shambles. Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter would become almost like a necessity, like gasoline, water, or food. You could just see people call it. Like you could see people getting upset. Oh no, I can't come in today. Like Facebook down. <laughs> like some people out there would be like utterly crippled if their Facebook just was like non-existent for a day. Or better yet, like think of somebody that went in, hacked your account, and then deactivated your account. If you're like me, I've been on Facebook since 2005. Like if somebody went in and hacked my account and deactivated my account, I would be uh, devastated. Don't nobody out there try it. Please don't, I, I beg of you. What's so fascinating about seeing people fight on, okay, I know what's fascinating about seeing people fight on Facebook. The fire challenge. Who thought of this? I'm gonna get in my shower, I'm gonna cover myself in a, in a flammable liquid, and then I'm gonna set it on fire and see if I can withstand it. No, stupid. That's just dumb. I'm watching one, this guy put 
so much on and it leaked down to where his uh, genitals were, like his, screw it, his balls. He got his balls covered in the liquid too. Fire travels, dummy. It's not gonna stay where you want it to stay. Not only is it gonna get you on fire, but it's gonna get your, your sack on fire too, dude. Like, think, sorry, your cojones. It would appreciate you not setting them on fire. Sorry. And then after that thought, I think the thought of being granted three wishes and immediately the first wish was to never run out of wishes that the genie had to grant no matter what. But that could turn into a paradox if you know what a paradox is. I'm, I'm hoping that you do. Um, Cause think of it, if you, would, if you had unlimited wishes, like you could have anything on the planet that you wanted absolutely anything that you wanted. Except for an honest time whenever you said like, oh, I wish I was dead, or I wish that he would drop dead, or I wish that she would get hit by a truck. Then you kind of want to be like careful with your words, because then that would suck for you and for the other person. But hey, you have unlimited wishes. You can wish them back to life, and then they kind of be like the walking dead, like literally the walking dead. Um, I have a lot of random thoughts all the time. like. Absolutely all the time. Take a sip of my coffee. But seriously, on a serious note, if there's anything that you would like to see me do, just comment down below in your screen down there. Well, not in your screen, but like in the laptop, obviously. Uh, exactly what you would like to see me do, or the parts of my life that you would like to know more about. And uh, I'll be sure to take the cannon with me and record it. Uh, make sure that you follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Posterboy, P-O-S-T-E-R-B-O-I. Uh, the Y was already taken. Uh, and also you can find me on Facebook at Franklin D. Williams Jr. Yes, I know I have a long name. Okay, yeah, Franklin D. Williams Jr. Franklin D. I'm out.